the thing that I'd like to bring your attention to next is the, the interactions between natural variability and the anthropogenic change that we're seeing in the temperatures. So there's a, an animation um, that you'll be seeing very shortly which identifies the temperatures that go, um, at, at, across the, the global uh, land surfaces that go back to the 1880s and they go almost to present day uh, and we look at the monthly temperatures uh, for each of those years and we also compare those temperatures against an average so what we would call a climatology. For every January monthly average temperature, we compare that with an average over maybe a 30, 40 or 60 year period. So if that particular year is warmer than that average period or that climatology, we say that's a positive anomaly. And if it's colder, then it's, uh, we, we talk about a cold anomaly. So in the animation, what you'll see is that once the animation starts, we have uh, monthly temperature anomalies. And in the earlier part of the record, starting in 1880, we have a, a sort of equal number of hot months and cold months. But there is a lot of variability that's occurring because of all of these natural processes that are going on. But what you'll see is as you move through the, the, the sort of 1920s, 1930s, 1940s, you start to see that the number of cold anomalies actually disappears. So when we get to 1996, um, from 1996 through to the end of this particular record, which I believe is in, in, at the end of 2018, there are no, there's only one actually, one cold uh, monthly anomaly through that entire record from 1996. And when we look at the size of those anomalies, so how different, how much larger are they than that long term average, over the most recent record, some of these months are actually almost 2 to 2.2 degrees warmer than that average uh, monthly uh, record. So quite clearly we're starting to see the anthropogenic signal um, interact with the, the natural climate variability, but clearly that there is this warming trend that's going on.